Welcome back to another AI Practitioner Exam Byte, reviewing the question from the previous episode, asking us which two of the following generative AI use cases would be most beneficial for this system. The answers are B, chatbots for handling initial customer inquiries, and E, translation for supporting customers in multiple languages. While the other options have valid uses in different contexts, they're less directly beneficial for a customer support system focused on improving service quality and efficiency. All right, so today we are starting the second task statement in our Fundamentals of Generative AI domain, which is task statement 2.2. Understand the capabilities and limitations of generative AI for solving business problems. In particular, today we're looking at two exam objectives. Describe the advantages of generative AI, for example, adaptability, responsiveness, and simplicity, and Identify the disadvantages of generative AI solutions. For example, hallucinations, interpretability, inaccuracy, and non-determinism. Let's start by looking at the advantages of generative AI. The first being adaptability. Generative AI models can quickly adjust to new tasks or domains with minimal retraining. This flexibility makes them incredibly versatile. Next up, responsiveness. These models can generate human-like responses in real time, making them perfect for chatbots and interactive applications. Next, simplicity. Despite their complex technology, generative AI systems often provide simple interfaces for users, making advanced AI capabilities accessible to non-experts. And finally, creativity. Generative AI can produce novel content, ideas, and solutions, potentially enhancing human creativity and problem solving. However, just as with any technology, there are some disadvantages. The first and probably most widely known are hallucinations. Generative AI can sometimes produce false or nonsensical information, which we call hallucinations. This can be problematic in applications requiring high accuracy all the time. Next is interpretability. The decision-making process of generative AI models can be opaque, which is just a fancy word meaning hidden or obscured, which makes it challenging to understand how the models arrive at particular outputs. Next, inaccuracy. While often impressive, generative AI can sometimes produce inaccurate or biased results, especially when dealing with complex or nuanced topics. And finally, non-determinism. Given the same input, generative AI might produce different outputs each time, which can be an issue in applications requiring consistency. Although that can also be considered an advantage given the creativity generative AI models can output. So as an AI practitioner, you'll need to weigh these factors when considering generative AI solutions for various use cases. Let's do a review question to finish off. Which of the following statements about generative AI is false? Generative AI always produces consistent outputs given the same input. Generative AI models are highly adaptable to new tasks with minimal retraining. C, hallucinations in generative AI refer to the production of false or nonsensical information. Or D, the simplicity of generative AI interfaces makes advanced AI capabilities accessible to non-experts. Post your answer in the comments and we'll review this next episode where we're going to look at the factors we should consider when selecting generative AI models.